Morning, fellas. It's what, about 8.30? And we're about, what, 66 in the garage? And yeah, we finish up the lighting. Did that yesterday. So hold on, let me turn this thing around. So hold on, let's see if we can. So I had Richard, when we did it, we put the switch here. And as you can see, it lights up the garage pretty well. Uh, still don't like the lights right above me and I'll turn the camera around and show you. Uh, so hang on. Uh, these got the hood on them and they're, they don't they throw mo more light directly down than they do across if you understand what I'm saying versus those lights so uh, next week I have to be in Birmingham Alabama for my committee meeting with the International Code Council on uh, commercial and residential fire sprinklers and that'll last. I'll leave fly out Tuesday and come back Friday and then the following Tuesday Richard and I are going to change these lights out. It's the buddy of mine who's the IBEW electrician. We're going to change these lights out and uh, put in that style fixture. I'll pick those up this weekend. Also we changed that dual uh, that two outlet plug to a four outlet plug because I want to hang another drop light right up in there and we had to relocate the garage light so but all in all it's starting to get bright in here and I'm beginning to like it today is still going to be cleaning and working on it uh, working on getting the garage turned over to uh, to paint the Camaro uh, as you can see I've got drug out the sanding blocks, sandpaper, masking tape, and everything else. Uh, let's see the goal. The goal is is to start masking and sanding this thing down. I'm going to start up here at the front. The tape's on the hood to sit there and show me where I have to grind down. If you all remember, I welded rod on the end of the hood to close up the gap. So I got to grind that down to get the then to get the uh, gap even. So the tapes to show me where I have to grind down. I'm going to start on the front of the car and I'm just going to work backwards. So I'm going to go sit there and do the driver's door, then go do the passenger door, do the roof, do the driver's quarter panel, do the left quarter panel, do the C pillars, come down, deck lid, tail light panel. And then I'm going to start masking it off. And that's what my goal is. Uh, I've got Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and part of Sunday to uh, get darn close. Monday I uh, leave for packing and Tuesday morning I gotta be at the airport at 8 a.m. Yeah, I get to fly to Tampa Bay to go to Birmingham, Alabama. Still trying to figure that one out. So that's the goal. Uh, when I come back I want to be able to shoot another coat of 2K on this thing and then get ready to block it out again. As you can see, we're a very gloomy day in Vegas. Temperature is roughly about 65 right now. So it's definitely not a John Kerry day. And we will be working with the garage down, door closed today. Uh, I'm going to pull this back out into the driveway. I'll put that in the street in front of the house. Uh, I'm going to knock all the dust down from this. These are the screens on the house. when. Uh, we moved in here we had uh, what is called solar screens I don't know. there you go you can see them solar screens put on the house help keep the UV rays out keep your energy costs down and rather than throwing out all the other screens <clears throat> I just saved them up here and plus let's see there's the grill for the Camaro the door regulators are there there's the dash pad and a few other Camaro parts are up there. Well, I want to pull that down and get knock all the dust off it, get it all cleaned up, and then put it back up there and uh, reorganize that. And that's what I'm going to be doing today. So, as always, when I have more, I'll turn this back on. Later, guys. Hey, guys. It started drizzling out. I had to bring the car back in. 
I did get that done now. Got it. I moved it over that way a little. Gave us clearance here for the lights. So when I get ready to pull those down and replace them, also uh, that strut for the garage door opener, I'm going to trim that back because when I put these lights up, I want to move them that way just a little bit and see if the flashlight will work. And as you can see, there's the last bolt right there. Oh, there's the last bolt there. So there's one, two, three, four, five holes that extends over. I'm going to cut it off <clears throat> so I can move the light over. So the drizzle, if it's, it stops drizzling, I'll pull this back out and we'll do something. If not, then uh, I'll have to wait for tomorrow, better weather. But tomorrow is sanding. Uh, tomorrow we're starting on the sanding. Uh, it's I, I'm not going to be playing in this garage anymore. i got to get this thing sanded and start masking this thing up. So, as always, thanks for watching. When I have more, I'll turn this back on later. Well, well fellas, I'm going to call it a day. Uh, going to take my wife out. She just got off of work, and we're going to go out for a little bit. Uh, you know, the weather hasn't changed much. It's still overcast. Every now and then we get a cell running through here, and it drizzles. And I wanted to work in the garage with this outside. So uh, tomorrow will be a different story. The weather's supposed to be gone. Uh, and start standing on this. Uh, I'm still getting all the supplies out and getting them on the bench. So, and also I ran to Home Depot and got the two other light fixtures. You can see them back in there replace these two and we're kicking around putting a third one just kicking around putting a third one right here over the bench so still giving that some thought won't do this until I get back from uh, Birmingham Alabama next week and uh, that's pretty much it so <clears throat> if I do anything tomorrow on the car, it's going to be starting on the, on the body work or jump back on the body work and sanding it and start masking it around. Uh, doing some body filling, getting a few things going. As you can see, this is pretty well rippled here. So if we could sand this out, we'll see if we can. If not, I'm going to probably make maybe some glazing or just some light filler over it. But uh, yeah, we're going to start, uh, start in front and work our way to the back. Uh, bouncing from pat drivers to passenger side but I want to do most of the sanding this time outside uh, so we don't get uh, get the garage all messed up as I've been slowly starting to clean this when I come back the next shelf to tackle will be all that and getting getting rid of some of that uh, thin box up there right there that's a brand new flywheel for a small block uh, let's see that blue container right there That's what my third member came from from curry And I figured I'm going to hang on to that if I ever decide I have to ship it back But there's a few things up there. We can trash and get rid of so that'll be the next thing and to do that uh, I'll probably leave the car in the garage, but pull it over mostly to here But I'll do that when I get uh, back from Alabama And then everything has been gone through Except for the house paint shelf, but I won't mess with that so, as always, thanks for watching. When I have more, I'll turn this back on. Later, guys.